Well, presidential hopeful and former Palmetto State Governor Nikki Haley had several events of her own today with her first stop in downtown Newbury outside the Opera House. Chief investigative reporter Derek Rush has more after hearing from Haley and some of her supporters. In a full day of campaigning across the state, former South Carolina Governor Nikki Haley's first stop was at the Opera. Singing their song as former governor and Republican presidential candidate Nikki Haley made stop one of her campaign bus tour at the Opera House in Newberry. Uh, we'd like to see her give it a real big go. I think she's got a lot of push behind her and uh, we like what she stands for. The last GOP candidate standing in the way of former President Donald Trump's return to the Oval Office. Haley spotlighting former President Trump's legal troubles. And then the campaign disclosures come out. And we see he spent $50 million in campaign contributions on his personal court cases. Think about that. Along with he and President Biden's age ahead of the February 24th South Carolina Republican primaries. Now you have the special counsel saying that he's got a bad memory, that he's not mentally stable or competent. Your choice is do we want more of the same? Or do we want something new? With the thought of the potential of the first woman to hold the title commander in chief remaining a topic of conversation. But I have said there will be a female president of the United States. Well, my heart is, uh, it doesn't matter to me, man, woman, uh, color, black, white, brown, doesn't matter as long as the person in office can get the job done. Put America first, be great to have a woman as president, but we want the best person for the job. I think she would be a great person for the job. In Newberry, Derek Rush, WIS News 10.